What is up guys? Welcome to yet another Madden 20 modding tutorial and in today's tutorial as you can see here I'm going to be showing you how to edit the X Factors and abilities in Madden 20. So to do that, uh, what I'm going to show you here today is how to change the portrait of the X Factor um, player, how you can change the icon of the X Factor, and how you can change the name and description, as well as how you can assign uh, everything to players. So with that said, uh, for this tutorial you're going to need Madden AMP, which will be in the description, link to that, and Frosty Editor. So with that, let's hop into Frosty. So hop in Frosty here, and what you're going to want to search in here is Base Roster Abilities. So you're going to go down here, Global, D-Sub, In-Game, Football Abilities, D-Sub, Ability Associations. So you're going to click on this, Base Roster Abilities. So in here, we've got 109. This has all the um, players with X Factors and Abilities in Madden. So I'm going to show you all first. So first we need to create our little player to uh, give him X Factors. So I'm going to go over here to Madden AMP. And I'm just going to choose a player from um, from the official roster. Or er, let me just find a roster. Um, this roster. So this this is just a random roster I have. So we'll go here to player editor. So I'm just going to pick a random player here. So I'm just going to go to the I'm just go to the Cowboys and or er, let's see. Oh. Uh, huh. Uh, let's go to the Vikings and say we want to give Kirk Cousins an X Factor, but we will change his name. So, what if we want his name to be John John Doe? And uh, so we've got that. So with this asset, you want to change. You want to create your own asset. So it's gonna be fir last name, first name, underscore, and then a random number. I not sure like what number it needs to be so I'm just gonna pick a random number and if it doesn't work yeah just try a different number so doe john underscore one two three four five uh, I assume that's not taken if it is that stinks so you're gonna go ahead and copy that asset there for mr. John Doe um so I've copied that and I'm just gonna save that once we're here um, you're gonna click the plus sign here, and we're gonna go all the way down to the bottom, and see this empty space. We're gonna paste our asset there. So another thing is, if your player already has like an asset, like if you're doing a face scan or anything, you want to copy that asset and not like your custom one. That's just just a heads up there. So we've got our Doe John here. So let me tell y'all what everything is. So this is enabled in Pro Bowl here. This is if you've made a Pro Bowl mod and you want your player to have an X factor in the Pro Bowl. So for that, and then player image index. This is the player image that it takes. So you can put a random Im random number here. Like I'm just gonna go three five five. I assume that's a portrait. <laughs> I have no clue. Um, there. Let's just do hundred. Um, and then here we can do the description, like, he throws, he throws dimes. That can be a description there. Alright, so now we need some abilities and some X factors. So, what if I want to, so, let's give him, for example, first one, say we wanted, or he's a quarterback, so, let's give him bazooka. So, you have one of two options. You can either search in, uh, you can't search bazooka, by the way. You have to search like 15 plus yards. So I'll show you all that in a second. So we'd have to go over and find Patrick Mahomes, but that's going to take all day. So I just kind of like to search. So let's go here. Um, probably 15 plus. You kind of have to just look around. Um, maybe search like throw. And then you can find him here. Like increase max throw distance. So that's it. So you're going to just click it once. And then click the arrow here, click a plus here under active abilities, and then click that arrow right there. So you're going to go there, and then you add it. So now we need activate logic and deactivate logic. So to do that, you can either find a QB to just grab from, or you can find ones. So 
I'm just gonna find a QB and uh you'd probably want to find a QB so I'm just gonna take or no Kyler Murray doesn't have yes yeah, so you probably want to find a QB um so you kind of just have to search through these one eternity later okay so let's take Lamar's here so I know he has first one free but um we're just gonna copy these passer sacked so you can edit these like so whatever you want your thing to activate as uh, you can make that. So let's just say yards rushing. Like I know, I know that wouldn't be a real one in, in real life, but I'm not gonna t waste my time to find my homes. So you've got that. So now we're going to go to the passive abilities and elite scramble loco. That is um, that is escape artist. So you kind of have to search around. I recommend not searching this stuff. Just finding quarterbacks that you want. So let's just say we want to give him escape artist here. So, there, we've got our Q QB. Now, say we wanted to change the name or the description of our X Factor. So, we're going to go over here to the bazooka. So, just know that if you do this, it changes it for every player that has bazooka. So, you're going to look through these. So, this is the description. Max throwing distance increased by 15 plus yards. So, say we want to change this. Um, so, say we want to change this ability to, uh, to rename it Missile. And we want it to be increased... Uh, throwing distance by 30 yards so we can change the description there now that actually won't change it in real life you have to find it see here is the uh is, here's the description the the huge description when they enter this in maximum throwing distance so we want to change that to 30 here so that's the other description now the next one uh don't worry about that bazooka so so say we want to change it to missile so there we go it's missile uh instead of bazooka so now we got to go down here and this sometimes can be hard we've changed it to missile i know that um even though we haven't changed the uh the amount. I will show you all how you can change the, um, the, uh, how many, like the activate logic. So you can go to open the asset and then you go to objects and you find the drop downs. See, so you have to rush for 10 plus yards three times. So say we wanted to change that value and make it, um, so say we want to rush for it five times. That'll turn it into, um, making it five. So now let's say we want to change his portrait. So his portrait is 100, but I, w I would actually like find the portrait ID and everything. So we're going to go to legacy explorer and it's uh, common UI Madden swappables. And then it is so here, this is where you can change the player ability browser, if you're uh you if you want to change that. But the um the X Factor um portraits and everything it's going to be under player player hero poses .ast. So see, I'll click on one. See, there's Denzel Ward. So this is where you can change the X Factor pictures, and this lines up with everything. I'm not going to show you all do a thing on this, but it's it's. Th same thing as like a custom portrait or anything like that with the ASD editor and then this is how you change the X factor it's the same thing with the player hero portrait so this is icons.ast this is how you change the um, the picture uh, of the icon of the X factor and so like say we wanted to uh, replace blitz radar here so we could just make our own and then import it over and it changed blitz radar so now uh, we're gonna load this up into we're gonna launch this and see our player uh, John Doe with his X factors okay so once you have loaded your roster file make sure you load your roster file you can go over here to the superstar X factors and you'll show you see how it says missile over there on the homes but if we go down go to the Vikings we have mr. John Doe over here and it says he throws dimes so thank you guys for watching and have a great day peace